Bonsoir, j'ai dit de tonight we are at the Louvre, at the great gallery of Michel-Ange. Peter Silverman, a Canadian collector, just offered a great sculpture of Italian Renaissance to the Louvre. It's a Christ on cross, perhaps who knows by Michelangelo. Till 1985, this work was absolutely unknown. Well, the Louvre has nothing like it, first of all. They have uh, the slaves of Michelangelo, but they have nothing else that can compare um, as a crucifix. And second of all, I wanted to make sure it was protected. Protected because it has been lost for 500 years, unrecognized, and the fact that it's now on the Louvre, we know that when I'm no longer here, my wife is no longer here, we know that the work will be in a safe place and because it belongs to the patrimoine, the l'humanité, you know. It's a wonderful Christ. I mean, the, the way it's done, you know, the anatomy, the polychromy, the way is is dying. That is the main, most important thing. Some specialists came in the Louvre to study it. We had a radiography, study of the polychromy, and everything is about Florence in 1500. I mean, it's the very beginning of the, of the 16th century. Very beginning. Aesthetically, many important people besides um, those who were consulted by the Louvre believe it's by Leonardo, by, by Michelangelo. And we'll see with time, that's why it's here, so that it can be discussed. So how many experts on the five who saw the work said it was Michelangelo? Two out of five said it was, one of them was not sure, and two said they thought it was a great work of art, but not Michelangelo. But there are many other specialists and experts who had seen it when it was with, with us, who have um, believed that it was by Michelangelo. Mm -hmm.